Thanks for getting me out of there. As detention cells go, it had definite class, but I prefer being out on my own all the same. I owe you and Mandalore one. Wrong place, wrong time. Captain Sulio and I were acquaintances. I just happened to be too close when she got dead. Real shame. She wasn't bad to look at, and she could drink. No, and at this point, I don't care. Just glad to be free. She's dead now. Not like finding whoever did it will bring her back. I deal with death all the time. We all end up like her eventually. Not many people can help you out with that. There have been several assassination attempts on Queen Talia. That place is locked tighter than a hut's vault. I know a few people, though. Who do you need to get in touch with? A Jedi Master, you say? Now that is interesting. There's quite a bounty in Jedi these days. Not that I'm looking to collect, but if there's a Master there, I think I know who it is. There's a slight problem with that. I know you don't want to hear that since you went through all the effort of springing me out. The thing is, scavengers have already looted most of my stuff. Most of it's garbage anyway, so I don't care too much. But I did have a couple of encrypted holodiscs that they nabbed. So here's the punchline. I need those discs because they have some contact information on them. The people I know you don't just walk up and chat with. There's a procedure. And that holodisc has the procedure. The Kells gang pretty much owns this street. From what I hear, she's the one to clean me out. She's in the local cantina most days. She's tough as Drexel leather and more dangerous than an angry Wookiee. If you take Mandalore with you, though, you should be just fine. Just get me the encrypted holodisc. After that, if there is a Jedi Master in the palace, I'll get you a meeting with him. What do you want here, Offworlder? The room is taken. The whole cantina is taken. You should leave. You? And just how do you intend to do that? It isn't for sale. I warned you, Offworlder. Kill her! <laughs> See you again. I was sent by the Republic Senate to investigate certain delicate matter. I have to get to Coruscant to deliver my report. But days before I was planning to leave, they started requiring star. After the Jedi Civil War, the Republic was weak, and the cost of the Jedi Order was if Onderon secedes, other worlds may follow, and that can't. Trade between our worlds has brought economic prosperity, and people just take it for granted. 
All worlds are now interconnected. The Senate also smooths over differences and is a great instrument for peace. If the Republic falls apart, a thousand little wars born out of petty rivalries will erupt over time. Eventually, the entire... I really can't say. The most I will say is stay clear of General Vaklu. His ambition knows no bounds, and Vaklu may very well win if I can't get to... Thank you for the tip. The journey to Coruscant would be more costly and attract more attention. But there are many freighters bound for Telos. My mission requires the most extreme caution and delicacy. I don't want to risk going through channels to get a visa. General Vaklu is not above arranging an accident for me. I'm taking a great risk talking to you, but I'm running out of options. Thank you, but this is a personal starport visa. It is key to you and you alone. I appreciate your gesture, but I need an open starport visa. Helping me is not without its risks. I know you have Jedi training, so you can probably handle it. But I may be being watched. If, if that would compromise your mission, perhaps we should go our separate ways. <laughs> looking for one you've done a tremendous service for the Republic now I have to catch the first shuttle out of here
Japon and I got to found the encrypted holodisks yet. I won't be able to get a hold of my contact from the palace without it. Great going there. With these, I'll check my contacts at the palace. I should be able to get a meeting with your Jedi Master shortly. You got anything you need to take care of in the quarter. You best do it now. You're dealing with serious politics by contacting them. If things go bad during a meeting, you may not be welcome in ISIS anymore. Perhaps never. Just let me know if you want to go through with this. Yeah, yeah, I'll get on it. Just grab a cot and rest a bit. Once I get a meeting time, I'll let you know. Is this meeting a trap? I can't afford to lose you, especially given recent events. Anything could be a trap. Vaklu is no fool. But if the message is true... Is this necessary? I can guarantee your safety in the palace, but outside these walls the General has many men that would do anything for him. Nothing in life is certain, Your Majesty, but I feel something. There is a disruption in the Force. I must investigate this. Very well. But please, be cautious. Aren't I always? That's what I was afraid you'd say. Well, the meeting is on. Head straight to the cantina. You guys should be in there. And uh, no offense, but I hope I never see you again. You must have gone through a lot to arrange this meeting. The palace is a full battle readiness. Smuggling in a message is no small task. Kavar, the famed Jedi Guardian. The Mandalorians counted on the fact it would be you, not Revan, who would lead the Jedi against us during the Mandalorian Wars. I wonder how we'd have fared against you. I thought you were killed fighting Malak during the Jedi Civil War. It seems my former student keeps curious company. Strange times lead to strange alliances, though. No, I survived the war, if only just. Why are you here? I imagine that you hold little love for any on the Jedi Council anymore, even an old friend. <laughs> I'm not sure how well placed your faith is. I feared you would harbor dark feelings because of our treatment of you. You have to understand that it was a time of great uncertainty. We just learned that Darth Revan was back with an armada. Every Jedi that went with him was lost, corrupted, and as dark as their master. And then there was you. Many thought you were a spy, but there's more to it than that. And I think you deserve an expo- Am I interrupting? In orbit, I thought for sure that the Ebon Hawk was mine. I was certain, only to see you slip through my fingers during the battle. Imagine my delight to discover you were on Isis. Quite careless, if you ask me. Get them, men! And watch your aim! Civilian casualties cause a mess of paperwork. I must return to the palace. I'll get word to you when I'm able. Run! What? What have you done to my men? Blast! Men, take care of her! I won't let Kavar escape! This cantina is infested with life. A well-placed grenade could cleanse some of the dirty and insignificant souls here.
What's happening in the West Square? It sounded like battle. Command's ordered comm blackout. Do you know what's going on? What? Why? That makes no sense. Command hasn't issued any alerts. Are you sure it wasn't some of those Beast Rider slags? They've been getting bolder recently. You, you must be mistaken. Soldiers just don't attack civilians without orders. If it weren't for the comm blackout, I'd check with command. Just head to the safety of the Merchant Square, citizen. We'll send a patrol to investigate as soon as we can contact our HQ. Not all the military is after us. Still, Vaklu can throw a whole army at us. I think we've outworn our welcome over here. We should head over to the spaceport before General Vaklu invents some charges against us. Then we'd be in real trouble. <laughs> I told you before, Offworlder, the sky ramp is restricted to military. You know what to do. The diagnostic is doing something strange. Target acquired? What the hell does that mean? Pass here. I'll need to see your starport visa. Everything seems in order. You're cleared to go. Your visa's been scanned. You're cleared to leave. I'd leave right away. Things are going crazy in this quarter. I told you before. The Skyrim. I'm the. I. I. His loyalty runs deep, but perhaps there is another route to the. Con I suggest you move.
shuttle is just ahead. I think we should get out of here fast. It's gonna be some time before they forget about us here. No more trips to ISIS for us until the situation changes. A lot. Unnecessary observation. You are eliminating many of us Jedi, but such actions only delay the inevitable. Annoying recitation. Let us proceed to facilitate communications. Recitation. And bring about the term... docked here until further notice. I'm not ready to part company yet. It sounds like you have a lot of traveling to do. So do I. I'm going with you. The Sith have taken a particular interest in you, and you could use an extra blaster. I've been meaning to leave Duxon to look for other Mandalorian clans anyway. The Sith aren't known for sharing power. If the Jedi Order is destroyed for good, it's inevitable that the Sith will dominate the Republic. And then my people will be eradicated or enslaved. Helping your cause is a matter of necessity. Mandalorians helped Exar Kun during his war. We know firsthand how we'd fare in the service of their like. But that's enough for now. We'll have time to talk later. The Ebonhawk is patched up and ready to go. When you're ready to depart, we can ask the guide here to take us back to the ship. anytime soon. General Vaklu has a great deal of power. Even a Jedi couldn't defeat an entire army alone. I hear you handled Isis adequately. Mandalore has left me in charge until he has finished his journey to reunite the clans. If there is any change planet side, I'll send you a message. Our numbers swell. Our training homes us. The galaxy will be run. The perimeter is secure, Mandalore. There have been sightings of some of the larger beasts, but none near the camp. As ordered, the patrols have been pulled back, but they are ready to resume their duties on your order. Keep the patrols on standby. 
In the meantime, stay alert for any unwelcome visitors. As you command, Mandalore. We're looking into it. With your help, the relay dish is working again, so we aren't blind to the rest of the planet. The Onderon military has cordoned off the planet, so there shouldn't be anybody else down here. It's long. Ready to head back to your ship? Give the word and I'll take you there. Follow me.